All right, guys. So this is a trip. So this is the iPad Pro, uh, and I found a way where you can play your Nintendo Switch on your iPad Pro. So it's um, it does require a few components. So I'm going to show you how to get it all set up, and that way you can play your Nintendo Switch on your iPad. <clears throat> now a little bit of backstory. I've been on the fence with getting. Uh, the OLED switch uh, again I, I don't often pay play portable but when I do I, I, like, I like it when it's docked but I also like a better screen so I really like the iPad screen because it's it's a micro LED it's almost OLED but not quite but definitely you have more real estate here okay so what you'll need is a couple things you'll need first it's called the Elgato HD 60s plus okay so it's got to be a 6 HD 60s plus or better I think there's like a HDX or something but you need to have the HD 60s plus or it won't work uh, a lot of folks have the HD 60 and that's the older model so you gotta have that um, what I recommend is also having one of these USB hubs um, this is what's going to connect um, your interface to the iPad Pro to the switch okay um, also, you got to have, I like to have a, a shorter cable, especially when it comes to connections, uh, video connections. This is a USB-C to C, okay? So, let's go ahead and get it all set up. So, the switch is docked, okay? So, it's got the HDMI out right now, so it doesn't have anything to go out to. Okay, so it got a nicely labeled switch. Gosh, bad handwriting. Okay, so you, then you put that into your... Uh, El Gato. Um, so this one says out. You want to have one that says in. So you put that in in. Okay. Then you get your USB C. Put that in there. Boom. Okay. So that's your uh, input from your Nintendo Switch into your El Gato HD 60s plus. Okay. The other side goes into your hub here. Again, this is uh, the one that's going to interface with your iPad. Pro or anything any iPad with the USB C should work. Okay, so you put this into the USB C input, boom, and then this goes into your iPad Pro. Okay, all right, let's, let's get that bad boy in, boom. Okay, so now what you got to do is since they're all connected, find the El you have to download this Elgato app called Capture. And it's going to tell you if it's uh, connected. You can see here it's got Game Capture HD 60 Plus. Okay. Now you get your controller and then you activate your switch to turn it on. So you press the home button. There's the switch. And there you go. There's your Nintendo Switch running on your iPad Pro. And you can go ahead and make this full screen. Gives it black bars. It's pretty, it's pretty rad. Um, let me go ahead and fire up Mario 3D World. And let me bring it a little bit closer for you. But that is the Nintendo Switch running via HD, uh, the HD60 capture card into your iPad Pro, which is amazing. And it, and it controls amazing. Uh, I don't feel much latency here. That is amazing. So, just in case you guys might have an iPad lying around and you just want to have you know the ability to play on a bigger screen, uh, you can get definitely get that done again. You'll need a few of the accessories. You'll need the uh, hub here you'll need an Elgato 60s plus of course your Nintendo switch and then all that goes through this hub that connects to your iPad uh, Pro okay so just wanted to show you what your thoughts what are your thoughts are you doing it if you need any questions you need me to go slow let me know but don't forget to like comment and subscribe um, so definitely appreciate the support and we'll see you next time bye for now